When you don't eat, what happens in your body from a hormone standpoint is that your insulin is going to fall. You're going to allow your body to start using the calories that are in the body. So you're actually activating yourself. This is Dr. Jason Fung, a Canadian kidney doctor who's also written extensively about the benefits of intermittent fasting. I'm going to walk you through the five stages of fasting according to him. First, we start out in the fed state. And in this state, the body is digesting and absorbing food. Insulin levels are high and the body is not burning fat for fuel. Number two, in the post absorptive state, eight to 12 hours after your last meal, insulin levels start to drop and the body starts to burn stored glucose for energy. Stage three is ketosis, where the body switches to burning fat for fuel instead of glucose. And this occurs two to three days after fasting and the body starts to produce ketone. Stage four is autophagy, the process in which the body starts to recycle damaged cells and proteins. And this is typically three to four days of fasting. Finally, the body enters into the fasted state in which it's used up all the glucose and glycogen stores and it's primarily burning fat for fuel. This typically occurs three to five days of fasting. It can continue as long as the fast is sustained.